My name is Un, thanks a ton. I know you love that thing I've done. You've never seen the likes of me. Why, I'm the biggest thing since Parallel 3. Yes, as you can see, we've got our big bright shining star for Parallel 2 completion. And so we're going to get started on our way to Parallel 3. However, starting a game from here will result in the usual intro. And Garion once again waking up into a new cycle of reality. And there's really nothing new to see in Sea Bandits for this particular trip. So I'm just going to pull up a convenient save state I prepared for just such an emergency. And here we are. So in we go, and listening at the door, you'll find that we're actually early this time. Not too late, not right on time, but actually ahead of the line so we can be a little proactive for a change. You know, I never noticed before, but it looks like the captain has some kind of... possibly a Japanese character on his hat. Can anyone confirm that? <laughs> ah, good thing that's a rather thick door. Splash. That can't be good. And speaking of the captain, yeah, rather easy to be brave once uh, Bellon's jumped off the ship, isn't it? What about you? Yeah, it is kind of unfortunate when you get killed, isn't it? But as Jack suggests, let's go have a look at the trail, shall we? As usual, Bilan's been rather conspicuous in his passage. That's the spirit, Garion. And once again, we get a lovely pan around the K-Mobile. This time, she's got a follower. Eh, just like a puppy. Worst puppy ever. Anyway, this will lead us right on into Parallel 3. Uh, I will note that Parallel 3 is very short. Uh, the only thing that's shorter is Parallel 5, which isn't even a normal parallel. Uh, more than anything, it serves almost as a lead-in to Parallel 4 and is the only case where there's direct continuity like that. It does have Minecart Special Extended Remix, but that's not a good thing. In any case, Dark Savior Parallel 3, A Hunt for the Lives. Apparently we're being wiretapped. Uh, yeah, I got it the first time. Bad fucking idea! And so here we get uh, our first big divergence in the continuity. Instead of Drizzt going to town to trade the Bellanium for a weapon, Bruno's just gonna take it and try and bribe Bellan with it. I repeat, bad fucking idea. Meanwhile, let's see what's going on in K-Town. There's another difference. K gets promptly recalled to base. Uh, 
Ah, oh, Bruno, I really would have given you credit for more sense than this. I suppose you probably can walk pretty quietly on a big pillow of slime. <laughs> yeah, that's about what I'd expect. Also, ugh, 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 and it looks like Bruno is clutching his crotch. That's a really, uh, dirty tactic there, Bilan. If you can melt people and kill them with one punch, you really don't have to go for the groin. In addition to Parallel 3's brevity, uh, I believe uh, by the end of Parallel 2, if you're doing them in order, you've seen every unique area in the game, except for the extended uh, minecart sequence. So I'll probably be fast forwarding a lot to uh, hustle through the areas we've already seen, and just stopping for the changes. You know, everything that's different uh, fight-wise and plot-wise from Parallels 1 and 2. You know, it might have something to do there, uh, Kurt Ligon, with that shit you're mining that happens to be named after him. Well, speaking of JJ City, no one has much new to say. Uh, there are slight dialogue differences for some of the townspeople, but nothing really interesting. So I'm just going to chipmunk time my gathering of the medical chocolate and progression to the cafe. So I'll see you then. And here we are, back to New Plot. So here's our mission. We're going into Death Valley as usual, but this time we're going after Bruno. Never mind that I think Bruno's already been taken out of the picture pretty much, but uh, Kurt Ligon wouldn't know that, and neither do we. And also, since we haven't killed Bilan in this parallel, Butch still hates us. Anyway, what does our prison gate say this parallel? Knock on the door and the snake comes out. Jack! Anyway, we make our entrance to Parallel 3 in the usual fashion. Or, not to Parallel 3, we're already in that. Rather, Death Valley. And that's where I'm going to cut it for today. As always, thank you much for tuning in. This has been Un, and I'll see you again soon. Till then!